Okay, we're now in my office and I'm going to continue the scanning demo. These are the emails that I've received. I didn't type in a subject on there, so the subject line is blank and they come from Travis Anderson uh, with attachments. So let me click on the first one. Um, and since I didn't give the file a name, it has this um, long numerical code as its name. So I'm going to save it into my PDFs, and the first one was a Wikipedia article, so I'm just going to call it wiki as I type with one hand, wiki.pdf. I'll mm -hmm. save it, and I'll let Acrobat open it. Now you see it is, well actually it wasn't Wikipedia, but a chronology of Hitler. Uh, what you can do in Acrobat is, um, even in the reader one, you can rotate the pages. So I go into document. Um, rotate pages and I want to rotate them indeed clockwise 90 degrees. You can also do it counterclockwise but clockwise is correct. I want to rotate all the pages that way. I say OK. It rotates them and I have here my entire document as PDF and I will save it in that rotated format. And then I will go back to my email, get the next one, again numerical code. This one was a bibliography, so I'm going to call it bib, and save it, and, and you'll see it um, actually cropped it pretty well, and so I have this entire book as PDF. The thing that you can do if you have the full version of Adobe is you can go to document, OCR text recognition, that's optical character recognition and have it recognize the text, then you can make it searchable. It'll actually read all of the words in the text and make a much smaller PDF. So I won't wait while it goes through the entire thing and uh, reads it and converts it to text. But basically that's all you have to do to um, create a nice PDF that you can email to your students or use for your own use.